Hey guys, check it out. There's Kulika with Cherry. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Cherry's has a special day today. He's gonna have a spa day. He's gonna have a bath and he's gonna get his nails trimmed. Yeah, it's a special day for Cherry. And also, this video is for mm -hmm. Kathy Bueller. <laughs> Kathy won the snow melt contest a while back. And uh, we said we'd uh, mention that you in the channel and you can pick a video theme. And mm -hmm. Kathy said, she really enjoyed the, the spa videos and bathing that Cherry had. So this video is for you, Kathy, and everyone else that enjoys this kind of video. We hope you enjoy it. So let's get to it and start washing him. So we have the water running at a nice temperature. It's not too cold and it's not too hot. It's it's, it's more on the cool side, actually. Yeah, kind of lukewarm on, on the cooler side because uh, he has his natural oils in his uh, feathers, uh, protective oils that uh, you don't want to wash off. So. Yeah. And uh, Kulik is wearing gloves for two reasons today. One, his nails are very sharp and sometimes he can peck, so mm -hmm. she's protecting her hands. Plus, you can see him better with the gloves on. <laughs> and why do we like using the sink in the kitchen up here? It's, it's a nice stainless steel sink and it's a nice size. And it's easy to clean afterwards, so that's why we like to use that. Yeah, it's perfectly cleanable because uh, yeah, sometimes people say it's dirty, but you put raw meat in the kitchen sink and you have to sanitize it yeah. afterwards. So what's that any different? So I'm going to clean it good afterwards, don't worry about okay, it. Okay, Kulika. We'll see how he acts. He might jump a little bit, but you know, it's got to be done, guys. So look at that, guys. He's getting his belly nice and clean. <laughs> yeah, and why we're doing this too is Cherry was rescued, he was wild. He has a broken wing that was repaired, but it's it's never going to be the same. He cannot fly. A lot of you know that, but for the new viewers, he can't fly anymore. So we got him from the wildlife rescue. We adopted him. And uh, I'll put links to those videos on our channel. The story of Pet Crow Cherry with a broken wing. And uh, the broken wing is uh, it's just stabilized, but, but he doesn't have any... Uh like like any hold of it so he can't lift it up so it's a kind of dragging on the ground and it's getting dirty and the feathers are getting broken so we absolutely have to give him a bath every now and then yeah. because he's not washing we, we can't himself. verify yeah yeah we can't verify that he does bathe so we have to do this now and then also he's molting too like our other birds are some of them are molting they look kind of raggedy yeah he barely has any tail feathers so there are new ones are coming So he's all done with his bath, <laughs> and Kulik is going to do the trimming of those nails. Mm -hmm. So when you're doing the nails, like you're yeah, supposed to cover the head because then they submit and <laughs> they let you do. That's what the vet taught us too. That's what they do. They cover the bird's head so they can do their procedures. So Kathy, hope you're enjoying this video. We we really appreciate all the comments you leave. You've been on the channel for a long time, and you've donated to the channel. Thank you very much. Yeah, if you look at his claws, they are way overgrown. This is very uncomfortable yeah. for him. He can't properly perch on and he can't. It's, it's hard for him to walk on the ground too. Because look at that, this yeah. is way too long. All this sharp part has to be cut off. So That's cool. what the vet yeah. told us. Yeah, cool, because going to trim that. Like I said, this is the best place to, to wash and do the nails. There's lots of light here. There's a big counter space, there's a stainless steel sinks, and we can sanitize it properly. Yeah, just that a sharp part, because you don't want to cut too much, because then it will be bleeding. It's the same principle like cat, cutting uh, cats or dogs' nails, so you don't want to cut too much, otherwise it will start bleeding. Well, just got, a sharp end. She's got lots of experience with this. I've never done none of these, these procedures. Yeah, I'm doing it the way vet, does, uh, vet told us at the first place, so... Yeah, we learned a lot over the years going to the vets and they taught us lots too, so about feeding and everything. I'll put links below to feeding videos and other bird, like how the story of Cherry, you can see. Because some of you are new here and you don't understand why we have these birds in captivity. And we have uh, two other crows and we got two magpies and they're imprinted on us. Cherry isn't imprinted. Like he was wild and he still is and he's still hesitant to have us around too close. If you've seen in that last video, they were bathing at the farm and I had to film from a long distance because if I went up closer, he won't even go close to, to the bowl. And that's why we have to do this now and then because we can't verify that he's getting clean properly. 
And you know, we want him to be clean and healthy and everything. We, we love Terry very much. And he doesn't have much field or that wing, so he, uh, no. he can't clean it properly. And when he's bathing, he, uh, he doesn't get very good job done. So yeah, we have to do this now and then. So yeah, we're in the city right now. We have to do business here and we go back and forth between here and the farm. So we'll be there again pretty soon. So the last nail on this foot and then it'll be done. And he's all done. You can join the other gang <laughs> or the rest of the gang. Good bird. Yeah, this video's for Kathy. Kathy won the snow melt contest. Actually, uh, Peach picked her name out of a bowl. There was two two people that picked pretty close the same date. So Peach had to do the picking and <laughs> he picked Kathy. Yeah, thank you, Kathy, for giving a good idea for a video. Actually, we needed it done anyway, so we just needed a little extra motivation. <laughs> yeah. Good bird, Cherry. Very good. good well, there's little Cherry in the towel. <laughs> He's all done. <laughs> It's all He's done. He's happy it's over. He did not enjoy the procedure much. I'm sure he wants to go back with the others. <laughs> He's relaxed now. <laughs> so, Kathy, we hope you enjoyed this video. This video is for you and for new subscribers here and anyone else on our channel subscribed. It's for you also because you're, you're obviously here because you love birds. So, we hope you enjoyed this video. And thank you, Kathy, again for a great idea for a video. Because now we have a nice clean cherry in our hands. <laughs> yeah, and I said he picked your name out of a bowl. He picked it out of a cool of his hand, but same idea, right? <laughs> So guys, we'll be heading back to the farm and doing videos there again soon. So thanks for watching. See you in the next one. See you. Little Cherry can't wave right now. <laughs>